Making cornbread at home with a mix. Set the oven to 350. This is the mix we use, Bob's Red Mill. Add 10 times a quarter a cup or two and a half cups to the mixture. We're gonna weigh out or measure out one and a quarter cups of water. Make a little pile there. We're gonna add the water to the mix. Not all at once, we'll save a little bit. We're gonna add a quarter cup of avocado oil. You can use other kinds of oil. We like this one because it's a nice neutral flavor. That's the kind we're using. Two eggs, these are smaller. It says one in the recipe. That depends on how big your eggs are. These are from Meg's dad's farm, so we're gonna use two of them. Kind of fun, they're different colors. That's our egg recycling bowl. We actually grind those up and mix them into our garden. That adds nutrients to the soil. That beeping means the oven's ready. When you mix the mix, make sure to mix it gently. You don't want to mix it too much. We're going to add the rest of the water. Mix that all up. Don't over mix it. You want it kind of lumpy. We're going to use butter to grease the 8x8. I do nice even coating. I use a small fragment of paper towel to even it all out. Now we're going to pour the mix into the cooking glass that's been lined with butter as, as a greasing agent. Into the oven, we're going to cook it at 350 for 30 minutes. Four, three, two, one. Yay, it's done. We're going to remove it with heat protective mittens onto a trivet. The toothpick test makes sure that it's done. Looks good. Cornbread, fast and easy.